you're new to this channel, this is your first time of watching my video, please hit that subscribe button and also hit your notification bell. So that any day I drop any of my wonderful videos, you will also enjoy it as well. In this channel, I tutorial you how to bake, how to prepare different African dishes, how to bake from the scratch. Make sure you watch this video to the end. Here are all the ingredients you need for your chum brand to be a Sussex. You have your soya bean, you have your yellow corn, you have your peanut, that's granite. You also have your mid, uh, guinea corn, millets, dates, crayfish and so more you can also add plantain flour if you have take your time to wash all the necessary ingredients that you need select the corn if possible wash very well because it's my baby food i'll take my time to wash it before i dry Drain out the water after the second or third washing and you spread outside the sun. This is raining season, so I'll be spreading it inside my house, just in a room temperature to dry. Feel free to add your beans, feel free to add your plantain flour. It will also give you a nice text. For my soya bean, I will wash and soak overnight to reduce the acid content inside. Everything is dried up except my dates due to its raining season. You can also grind it, blend it fresh and put store in your fridge. You can scoop as you prepare the tom brown. But for this 
I will not be using it. I will set it aside for now. Start frying them one after the other. If you notice it's about to pop, like popcorn, you remove. Uh-huh, you can see it's popping up. You remove. Everything is well fried. I just missed in my soya bean, adding my peanuts, granuts, mix everything together and I will start blending. My date is yet not dry so I will not be using it for this Tom Brown. Please if you are able to dry your own please add it is very healthy. I bought this blender just for this my baby food you can use it to crush all your grains into pieces without no shaking if you have the smaller mixer that you use for crushing dry things you can use it but just that you to take time so I'm using this big blender to crush Continue to crush till everything is smooth. This is a lovely mixed blender. Please, if you're looking for a good blender, go for this blender. Very nice. Everything is crushed. Now, I will start sieving. I will sieve with my smallest sieve. Take your time because it's my baby food, so I don't want to be feeling any crumbs inside or any hard particle inside. So I'll take my time to sieve it before I prepare. To preserve this Tom Bram, you need an airtight container. Make sure there is no atom of water inside. Store and cover. You can store up to months, up to a year without no problem. This pot is only for my baby. I will scoop out one tablespoon of my Tom Brown, add water, mix very thoroughly. Be sure not to fill any lump inside. Set your gas on a medium heat. And begin to cook cook up to 10 minutes if you feel is getting thick cook and then make sure you you are okay with the consistency for is a baby food so I'll make sure it's light if it's a bit thick I will remove at least make sure it's up to 10 minutes so that everything will cook well are you seeing it I think I'm okay it's okay now I'll remove pour out Cube out my milk. This is my baby formula. Mix together. My baby will enjoy. Thank you for watching this video. Bye bye.